Hello, my name is Troy Gray, and I'm the director of Spindletop Gladys City Boomtown Museum in Beaumont, Texas. Today, we are in the dry goods store, and we are taking a trip around the a museum and showing you different objects, telling stories and that. And today, I have a good one. This, of course, is a Singer uh, sewing machine. And I researched a little bit before. Uh, my helper, Danielle, also researched a little bit about this today. And uh, I just thought this was kind of cool. So Isaac Singer was a mechanic with an inspiring acting career, performing plays by Shakespeare. When acting didn't work out, he returned to working as a mechanic where he would eventually repair a sewing machine. So, so well to the point where he tried to pattern it, but was sold by the original make of the sewing machine. He persisted with his perf perfecting the sewing machine and in 1857 was able to create a multi-million dollar company that we still use today. Singer sewing machines were very common, hence why they are a part of our museum. We have a few of these um, down here, upstairs. They would sell for $10. In 2021, that is about $327. Um, he worked in a dry goods store for a short time, a period of time. And this is where we keep our Singer sewing machine. He didn't work in Beaumont, but he did work in a, a dry goods store like this. But um, here's some things you may not know about Isaac Singer. He had a reputation of being a womanizer that began when while he was with his first wife, who was only 15 years old. He actually got arrested for bigamy, and he had 24 children with multiple wives and mistresses. And I just just thought uh, you might like the fact that he actually made the sewing machine in order to meet women. He thought that was, uh, um, or his model actually. We even have an early version over there of an early version of a sewing machine, not Singer, but early. So uh, this is something that many people like to come in and see, and I like the... Um, ornamentation of that so but anyway uh we have a lot going on right now we have the uh art show that we're showing in our uh caroline room the, there's three uh that uh, you can actually bid on on a so silent auction and that money is used for us we're in collaboration with this art exhibit with a, another nonprofit called the artists of southeast texas and so please come out and look at the art especially but also um see uh the uh see the um are in bid on it that helps our our uh, thing so um also um in that runs until september 26 so that we will have a closing show on that day and then after the closing show we will have our first uh, uh open mic and family picnic night that's from four to six on that sunday also we have three more spots for our Blaysmith class that's happening on September 11th and also for um, also for that September 11th we have a um, a wood carving class so please come out to that uh, that's only forty dollars the Blaysmith is 150 and uh, so Please uh, come out to that or call us and get information. Our number is 409-880-1750. Uh, uh, so g give us a call today or come on to our website or social media pages. I'll talk to you uh, next week.